Hey, what's going on guys? John here and welcome to Inside the Harmony, episode number 14. Today's episode is super exciting because up until this point, everything we've been doing is in the key of C major. We've been really working on our triads and exploring tons of possibilities, whether it's just going through the scale or moving in fourths or fifths and on all different sets of strings. But today we're gonna look at the key of C minor. So we're gonna be using the C melodic minor scale. And we're gonna take our first chord progression that we learned, and we're just gonna make one tweak to it to get the chords in the key of C minor. If you have a C major scale, do, re, mi, fa, so, la, ti, do, just the good old major scale, and you take the third note and you flat it, so instead of get. That's all we have to do and then keep the rest of the major scale the same to get the melodic minor. So we're going to take all our chords and any chord that has the note E in it will just flat it. Here's the first cycle of chords that's going to be just moving in seconds basically through the scale. Here's what it sounds like. So we're starting out on a C minor chord, and this is going to be the 10th fret of the D string, and then 8-8, eight, 8 eight on the G and 8 on the B. There's your C minor. We'll keep the 2 chord the same, the D minor. Now our 3 chord, instead of E minor like what it was in the key of C, is actually going to be an E flat augmented. So the way you play that is you play the 5th fret of the D string, 4th fret of the G, and 4th fret of the B. E flat augmented. So we've got C minor, D minor, which looks like an A minor shape, right? Just at the 6th fret. E flat augmented to F. This is going to be on the strings A, D, and G, we're going to play 8, 7, 5. That's an F. Then we'll go to G, same strings, 5, 5, 4. And our last two chords are going to be A diminished and B diminished. And then we'll finish back on the 1. So the A diminished, I shifted strings. I'm now on the low E, the A string, and the D string. I'm playing 8, 6, 7, and then 7, 5, 3, and then 3, 3, 1 for C minor. That's a really cool low voicing with the fifth in the bass. So the last three chords are A diminished, B diminished, So let's play that cycle together. So we'll go C minor, D minor, E flat augmented, F, G, A diminished, B diminished, C minor. Now what we're going to do is take this chord up the octave. So we're going to go to the A, D, and G strings. We'll be on 10, 10, 8 for our C minor chord. We're going to do the same sequence again, but now with different voicings. It sounds like this. C minor, D minor, E flat augmented, F, G, A diminished, B diminished, C minor. So, 8, 8, or sorry, 10, 10, 8 for our first chord, C minor. And then, 8, 7, 7, D minor. 6, 5, 4, E flat augmented. 
three three two F seven five five. I shifted up one string. Now I'm on the E, the A, and the D strings. Seven five five. That's a G. A diminished. A bit of a stretch here. Five three one. Same strings. And then B diminished. One two open. It's a really cool sound. Resolve. We can't go down to an E flat here unless we tune down, so we'll have to take it up the octave. So it goes from that B diminished to C minor, which is 6 5 5 on the A, D, and G strings. So let me play that second cycle for you C minor, D minor, E flat augmented, F. A diminished, B diminished, C minor. And we're going to go one more cycle through our chords. We'll start on this C minor and we'll play the same sequence just again with different voicings. Here's what it sounds like. So we'll start on the C minor, 6-5-5, five, five. then we'll go to D minor, root position D minor, I've got the 5th fret, the 3rd fret, and the 2nd fret. E flat augmented, really cool chord starting on the low E string, 7-6-5, then F, 5-3-3. G, 3, 2, open, A diminished, I shifted strings now, I'm on the A, D, and G strings, 6, 7, 5, B diminished, 5, 3, 4, and finish with C minor, 3, 1, open. And you'll notice that this is one octave below where we started. So here's the last cycle one more time. C minor, D minor, E flat augmented, F, G, A diminished, B diminished, C minor. All right, great job. If you made it to the end of this video, make sure you click the link below so you can get a free PDF that's over 100 pages. It's a book I wrote all about soloing that's really gonna help your playing. Let's try and put this whole sequence together that we worked on. We're gonna start with this C minor, and we'll go through all the chords, and we'll end on that low C minor. Here we go. Ready, play. C minor, D minor, E flat augmented, F, G, A diminished, B diminished, C minor. Take it up the octave, C minor, D minor, E flat augmented, F, G, A diminished, B diminished, C minor, and continue, C minor, D minor, E flat augmented, F, G, A diminished, B diminished, C minor. Here it is one more time playing each chord as a half note. Keep 
going. And on C minor. Alright you guys, thanks so much for watching. I really hope this video helped you out. Again, click the link below and you can get the free PDF that's all about soloing as my gift to you. Make sure you subscribe to our channel. We've got new videos dropping every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. So ring the bell notification so you don't miss a video. Thanks for your support and we'll see you in the next one.